Target 12 investigators are digging deeper into a plea agreement connected to a sex trafficking investigation. Local businessman who opened a high-tech greenhouse last year has pleaded guilty to a cocaine charge. She was arrested on a sex trafficking charge but never indicted. Two other men pleaded not guilty to sex trafficking of minor charges in connection with that case. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau is unraveling the details. This investigation involved a teenage girl who, according to investigators, was driven from Massachusetts to Rhode Island to have sex with one of the defendants. We circulate that area. When Louis Valenti turned himself in in May, the arrest warrant stated the charge was conspiracy to transport a minor across state lines for prostitution. The plea agreement Valenti signed does not mention that charge. According to the document, Valenti agreed to plead guilty to one count of possession of cocaine with intent to distribute in exchange for a recommended sentence of one year and one day. The sex trafficking case remains active for two men who, like Valenti, were arrested in May. Rene Loriano and Kedwin Vargas each face four counts. According to the indictment, Loriano delivered cocaine and the teenager to Valenti more than 10 times, with a document stating during several of the transactions, the girl had not yet reached her 17th birthday. The indictment states Valenti went to Rhode Island State Police in March claiming he was being blackmailed. Investigators said text messages stated if Valenti did not pay $10,000, sex videos of Valenti and the teen would be sent to Valenti's wife. At this point, the defense attorneys have not responded to requests for comment. Also, no comment from the U.S. Attorney's Office about the plea agreement. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.